Welcome back Stoner Squad and thank you for joining me today for some more Imperator Rome going for a Shocker's Pillars. So today we are going to get ready for a war down south here. Um, I want to get my aggressive expansion down to literally zero because then I can do one big war and we can probably take a lot of land in one go which will be fairly cool to do. Um, I also want to convert more, we need to keep going. Um, hopefully our policies down south will be working because we have got a lot of temples going. I would like to change the governor policies at some point um, but not yet. I need to see where what we are like province loyalty wise for the moment um, off camera i have got a massive road project going now if you look at these guys so you can see pretty much the road network that is going to be built um so it just kind of allows the movement of pops around this southern section to be a lot quicker and it also links up with the main road which is up north so it goes all around here and then links up there i want to continue it afterwards on this side so we can actually snake it all the way up to aracosia to actually get over there if we ever needed to quicker but for the moment here it's just for the quick movement of pot so it doesn't look like much to start off with but this is uh, basically the framework of the road it goes round this impassable zone here all along the border down south down along the coast and all just basically just to facilitate the movement of troops but anyway without any further ado let's get rolling bim bam and blue boom so who died Mahinda Sukha died. Poor guy, the pastor. So he's the aggressive expansion dude who got it down for us. Um, he's no longer around, um, which means you're going to have to put this guy. You're fairly young, so you can last for quite a while, so I'll put you on. Um, you're not great, but you will do. And um, it goes down by 0.34. Could be better. I would like it to be better. I'm not spending any of the gold because we need it to literally build the roads, and it is going to cost a lot. So um, that is why. I don't even know if I can actually finish the whole network with the amount of gold I've got, but we shall soon see. And um, province-wise, lordy-wise, it's still going down slightly, but it's not that much, so I'm not really worried about it, to be honest. Um, in the new area as well, it is... what? Well, it's fairly decent, actually. Have we got rid of the isolated province modifier? We have. It seems to me that it has gone. Which means we can pretty soon bang on some religious conversion down here, which will be fantastic. And we've got another proposal. Um, can you please stop trying to get me to marry you? I cannot commit to such a plan, which I will not do. I might actually find myself some random person to marry. Um, just because, yeah, I can't be bothered to keep getting the message. But what about you, Prinny Moria? Let's try you. You're old. I really don't give a damn. Actually, no, not that old. A bit too old, I've got to say. Hopefully someone who's like around about our age. You're pretty good, 56. A pad Pradyota. What's a Pradyota family like? Or the head of the family. Does he like me? He literally hates my guts. So what if I have to bribe you? I can grant you like a holding or two. Okay, that gets it up to 54. So then let's try and marry that Fadiota woman. It was 56, wasn't she? Was it? Which one was it? Was it you? No. Where's she gone? Where's she gone? She disappeared. I don't know where she's gone to. Oh, it's you. There we go. I'll try and marry you. Yep, they accept. That's cool. So now we'll no longer have any kind of people trying to send us marriages, which means I won't lose any loyalty with anyone else, which is finally good. Oh, wait a sec. Have I done... No, that's a governor. Have I put my force on... Have I put my army on, like, the one building the road? Have I put them on road building? I have. I got scared then. I thought I didn't put them on road building, and I selected that whole path for no reason. Whew! That got me a little bit scared. Only a teeny weeny bit. Um, there is a colonization, like, a colonization icon up here. It's for this, but I don't want to colonize it. Really, not yet. I don't need it. And it's just going to give another region for me to put a governor on, which means, of course, more wages. And I don't want to put any more wages. But the faith of a shocker lose 18 gold for 6 stability. Yes, please. High stability is king. We are losing a little bit of stability. I'm not going to sacrifice another pig. I want to keep the stability for the moment. I think I should probably get some claims going, actually. Let's get some claims. On what? Deep Sri Parvata? Get one on you. What about Shola as well? We can get one down here on Vanavasi, I think. Vanavasi. Um, yeah, get a claim on you. Want as many claims as possible to reduce the amount of war score we get during the eventual peace treaty when we go to war with these guys. Um, now I think it's time. Could I change? I'll probably change the religion. I can probably def. Yeah, you know what? Let's change some of this now. We'll go for some religious conversion. 
I can definitely do it a little bit. Here we lose a little bit of... I mean, here it's quite high. Let's change this to religious conversion. So that is done. This section maybe not just yet. Here it's going up slightly. I could change it here. Down by open 14. Yeah, it is going to be... It is going to kind of go up at some point. Because it's only because the aggressive expansion is really hurting us here. Hmm. Or is it because of aggressive expansion? No, it's not. Because it's not tied to pop happiness. So... Should probably wait a little bit before doing the rest, to be honest. This I probably need to put on harsh treatment. Yeah, I'm not going to spend any of the other... Actually, no. You know, I'll swap this on religious conversion as well. Um, I'm going to keep the rest now. I don't want to spend too much, getting too much tyranny in one go. But it should speed things up a little bit. Yeah, it does. It speeds things up a little bit. The more the more pops we get to our religion, the better it will be. 56% now, which is really good. I might actually speed the game up now because there's not really, there's no real need for me to keep it on speed 4 because not much is really going on, so. How loyal are you? Still loyal. I might hold you a triumph, actually. Yeah, I'm going to keep you as loyal as possible. It, some may think it's a waste of PI, but it's just because I don't want to redo my road network that I've already tried to do with you guys. It's like, I don't want to waste it. Anyway, barbs, where have they come from? Are you attacking my friend? Um, oh, well, my friend can deal with it. He's got 11,000 men. You should be able to deal with them. Come on, buddy. You shouldn't even need me. You should be able to do it on your own. So he's not dealing with them. Why? Pank or Patty? What's this? I lose more stability. Are you kidding me? Are you going to give me, like, a good event from time to time? Instead of these horrible bad ones? Um, no longer importing livestock over here. Okay. That's in the capital, so we need more. Can I get more grain? I can. Let's get more grain. More grain is good. Can I make any more claims? Who are you? You're at war with somebody already. Um, Granu is raided. I ain't going to spend the gold on that. I'm going to keep the gold. I'm going to spend the PI and the manpower. Because we have the manpower. The gold we need to keep. Are you on my land now? Oh, I beat them. Haha, <laughs> he retreated onto me and I beat him. So, I'm going to go and finish you off. Actually, he's retreating back on me. Oh no, is he gone? Oh, he's dead. Okay, that's good. Oh well. Alright, we need a new man tree. Don't know what you are. What's a man tree? I'm going to put the best man for the job. You. You're not corrupt. You're fairly good. Increase our legitimacy. Might as well. So I just must go down. 0 .0, 0 0.33 now it goes down. Not too bad. Could be better though. Um, gain 6 stability for 10 PI. Yes, please. Anything to do with stability is going to be absolutely vital. It's going to be more than vital. We're not losing any gold as we're building the road network, which is good. We're still building it. Good. Good boy. Good man. Keep building. We have a long way to go. And we're going to have to build that before we do the war. Um, God will the cast is barely on you. Um... Oh, yeah, I'm going to have to make him on everybody down here. So what we got here? North Mashimandala. Yep, let's do it. We need as many as we can get. Uh, friendship with this guy. So our tribe enabled Yarlung to start investing a lot of their treasury and opening up borders between our two nations. Gain 17 gold, gain an opinion of him. Yeah, no problem. Why not? Why not, my friend? I'll happily take that. Um, 39 now it's at. Uh, Pirates Ahoy! So a messenger has been sent out by Panshamakamoria from Suparaka. A fleet of pirates have attacked the port. It does not look like they're going to let up any time soon. He's asking for aid immediately to put an end to this. Do I help them? God damn it. I don't want to lose... I don't want to get the anti-piracy edict. So I'm just going to... He can deal with it. I'll lose some manpower. I have way more than enough manpower. So whatever. However, I do have potential civil war now. Because this guy's pretty peed off. So I'll grant you a holding. I should solve the problem for the moment. He's been recently bribed, so that's why I couldn't bribe him back. A legal chicanery. I'm going to gain the gold here. It's still, that's like one month road building. More barbs have risen, are you kidding me? 
All right, then, buddy, let's force march all the way over here. And I might build a fort there just to stop... Actually, no, I've got two forts in between that stop him from moving. I don't need a third. They have pillaged that, though. Annoying. Anyway, bureaucratic issues. We have issues keeping track of our satrapies as well as taking care of our people at large. With our bureaucracy stretched thin and our subjects becoming ever more unruly, as things stand right now, we have to care for one of the groups who are unable to control them both. Yeah, I ain't losing the grand, so I'm going to take the integrated culture happiness reduction. I have to do it. Um, I'll also bang on another conversion, top conversion speed there. That is also going to be cool. What is religion like now? So it's slowly starting to appear down south, which is what we want. And the more we change, the better it will be. Minister of Excellence in the national tax was 10%. Yep, that's a little bit more gold we're going to make, so why not? Um, and I think now we can probably start swapping some more policies. Um, but it is conversion here. Yeah, here I can't just yet because the pops literally hate my guts. Here they hate me as well. Here it's rising slightly. So I'll put all these conversion. Yeah, this is going down. This is where they're going to rebel, I think. What if I was to pop on harsh treatment? Oh, it's so close. That's really close. 0.09. So there the harsh treatments are working. I'm hoping that even though we are losing province loyalty, the religious conversion speed should, like, literally help the loyalty. I'm hoping that, anyway, before it hits zero, before we have, like, rebellions all over the place, because I don't really want rebellions. Uh, we've defeated the barbs, which is cool. Any more barbs? I forgot to say, where have they come from? Even more barbs. Okay, so looks like I've got a force march all the way down here. Unless... No, we have a... We have an army here. What are you doing over here, buddy? I thought I left you down there. You may have been disloyal at some point. Oh, hmm? well, fair enough. Let's go and deal with the bobs. Might as well. They're closer. Oh, he's died? Okay, we've got no more general here because he must have died. But they're still building the road, which is good. It's what I want. It's like still way off. It's going to take a long time to build this goddamn network. Literally a long time. But I'm not spending any of the gold because... I don't want to run out. As soon as we run out of gold, if we're building a road network, it's just basically going to stop the road building, and I don't want that. Now, what province can I make a claim on here? Norths, whatever it is. North Satyaputa? Maybe. Do I already have a claim on that? No, I don't. What about this place? Let's have a look what provinces there are. Now, I mean, that's a tiny province. I don't need the claims on that. Um, let's go on north, maybe. What do I want to make a claim on? Ishola. Oh, yeah, of course. It's not all their land, is it? So, what do I have here? I'll get a claim on south Satyaputa down there. And what about... These guys, can I, I'm still making a claim on them. Yeah, we'll just make the claims on these two. At least these two entities. Are these two entities are allied? They are. I could take them out with these. I'm so not worried. I'm literally not worried. I'm teaching Indor. So the people of Indor Vidaba have barely any Buddhist amongst them, even if they're part of Moria. We set up a plan to have some of our locals from the capital move to the city. Oh, yeah, please. So what we gain... A Kalingan Freeman in Palaputra moves to Indo, and a Magadi citizen does, but we set the religion of three um, Yardhub and Tribesmen for this, so hell yeah. For 15 PI, let's do it. Any conversion is going to be good. The more we can do, the better. So how's it going down here now? It's converted. Yeah, it's 2.3%. It's going quickly. About the cities. Still not enough down here, though. Need more. Need more, we need more. What if I could integrate another culture maybe and speed things up? Like, let's go on the culture section here and see where we have the most. Like, the Avanti, for example. Or no, the Beard Harbin, whatever. Where are these guys? And these are all down here. There's 501 of them. Um, what if I was to integrate these guys? Um... 
yeah, no, I need more integrated culture. If I get some more integrated culture percentage happiness, then I'll be more than happy to do it. But at the moment, I don't have enough. Uh, legal chicanery, we're going to gain the extra gold again. Um, however, someone has been peed off with me again. So I'm going to have to bribe this buddy again. And people are still annoyed with me. Oh, it's this guy. I'm going to bribe you back then. There we go. That solved the problem. Xenophobia. So heated debates at the court are often common, especially when there were so many prominent members of society involved. Um, lately, a wave of xenophobia has swept across Moria, resulting in foreign values being regarded with distrust. All intendants at today's debate agree that, however, that Mahafdama Pajota crossed the line today when he accused us of indulging in barbaric culture and practices. Now I'm going to start seeing you as a rival, buddy. I'm going to say it's practically Armenian. Screw you. You think I'm culture? Well, you're an Armenian scumbag. Oh, did I beat them? Oh, I did beat the bobs. Good. Uh, which means this fourth army now can move all the way down here. That works for me. Lucas, what are you doing, buddy? You still like me? Just about. Mm. I would like to conquer all of this before they try to go for us. Uh, I'm going to gain six stability here, I think. I'd have enough gold, so we'll go for the extra stability. It's free stability. It's so useful. Another potential civil war? You've got to be kidding me. Which douchebag this time is being an idiot? The Admiral. Oh, God damn it. I think I've given too many. I'm going to bribe you. I'm going to grant you a holding. And then I'm actually going to take control of your ships, buddy. And I might just um, split in half to reduce your power base. I can reduce your power base considerably. That would work for me. Oh, he died. Are you kidding me? Oh, I didn't check if he was dying. That's my bad. Oh, well. I should have checked if he was dying. The Faith of a Shocker. 18 gold for 6 stability. Yes, please. Again. So now up to 58% stability, which is quite nice. Which is slowly slowing down the... The province happiness reduction. Um, still there. It's still annoying. And it's still going to take a bit of time to sort out. Do we need a new Samin Haditor, whatever that is? And oh, you're really good. I think oh, it's a tax guy. Um, oh, these are all really corrupt though. Ah, oh, god damn it! I'm going to put you, even though you're corrupt. I am still going to put you because you can increase our tax quite well. Um, have another potential civil war kind of firing out now. Um, you're the head of the Shunga family. You're dying, so I don't need to do you. Um, this guy's got low power base. Oh, this governor, he's like really annoying me. Ran you another holding, buddy. Just leave me alone. God, he's really, really annoying. Can I make you into a Buddhist? Can I force convert you? I can't. Well, you're old. You're 72, so hopefully you're going to die soon, which would allow me then to place a governor of, like, more... a more trustworthy one, if you wish. Ah, so the road is being built. This is great news. Good, this is good. The quicker it goes, the better. We're down to 25 aggressive expansion. Anyway, Madiamika prospers. So the Council of Madiamika has sent an envoy proclaiming the harvest, trade, and taxation of all producer food surplus this year in a show of solidarity. Um, a national spirit side, they've decided to offer the additional income to the state. But I'm going to go in province loyalty. Where is the province, though? Up here. Which one? Do I need province loyalty? Okay, let's gain the province loyalty. More province loyalty is good. We need that at the moment. So here it's slowly spreading down this section. Again, it's going to take a long time, but we need it. By the way, can I get some temples over here? I think I can spend a little bit of the gold. Yeah, I can spend a little bit here. Not all of it, but we can spend a decent amount. To get some more conversion going. That up here. Isn't there a building slot there? I think there is. Yeah, I have. I've got a few building slots. Let's go for some temples there. Okay, that's fine. That's more than enough. Okay, yeah, legitimacy is good. Tyranny is going down. Like that. And with it, the threshold of civil wars goes down. Press expansion's going down. Everything's looking a lot better. I'll be happier once we hit zero stability. Um, zero, not zero stability. Zero aggressive expansion. That means I can declare my big war. I might need to increase the size of the army, though. Because I think on road building, the maintenance has increased quite a lot. 
Anyway, raising a host. So Nandivardhana Pradyota and Capacity General has begun using his own funds to augment the first side of his army. Ah, uh, god damn it. I'm going to let you have the troops in the fourth army here, but then I'm just going to get rid of them. And I'm going to assign them to a governor, which will be this one down here, because I know this is a region I have one tiny bit of land in. And I'm just going to assign them onto that governor. That would work for us. And then we already have a small governor force ready. Nearly. I'm no longer exporting vegetables, earthenware, livestock. There's a lot of stuff I'm not doing. I need a surplus of veg, so let's get some more veg. And I can't. What about fish? Can't do that either. Grain. Can't do that either. Livestock. I can. Let's get the livestock. One my army of road builders. Um, Ashoka Moria died. Who was that? He was the Purohita, which was the religious dude. I'm going to put you. You're the best man for the job. You're pretty decent, actually. Um, I have a scorn family, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to use a little bit of a trick here. Um, I'll assign it to this navy here. I'll just assign one of the scorn family members. If there is one. There is one here. He's actually not bad. He has... Oh, he's a good commander, though. So, I might assign him to this army here. Wow, this guy is uh, pretty good. He's got Conqueror, Cruel, and Disciplined. Uh, but I'll assign this guy. Heavy Cab Discipline. Why not? So you're going to still keep building your stuff. Are you loyal to me? You are loyal. You're very loyal indeed. And let's have a look at our um, heirs and stuff. Because I want to make sure they've... Oh, so he's finally got some children growing out. They've got some sons. What about the second child? You probably need to... I should probably seek a political marriage with some of the others. Um, who can I seek a political marriage with? The researcher. Well, let's seek a political marriage with you. See if I can find one. It'll allow us to get more opinion with um, some of the families in our realm, which is going to be vitally needed. Uh, where is my... For the force. I know I have a 20k stack up here. I might bring them down. Um, or she advances for war score cost. I might go for some of that at the end of the road building. I think at the end of the road building I should have enough to get two pieces of tech and the war score cost is something I would want. Considering we are going to take a lot of land, it would be nice to reduce the amount we're going to take. What next? I mean, there's not really much I can do now. It's just a question of really waiting. I'll cool down the omen again. Pop conversion speed. Thank you. Keep all that going. Come on, boy, spread. Spread, spread, spread. A part of state. I'm not donating gold for six stability, so not going to happen. It's cost too much. And a petition approaches. This is good. I'm going to take a grand here. And this grand would enable me to go for some tech now. Like, for example, the natural slave output, which would give us more gold. The monthly wages for characters would be good. The research points is nice. You know what? We're going to go for the sponsored research. Which is really nice. And I'm going to go for the... Cassus Belly War Score cost. We'll still have two grand. Which is more than, like, yeah, 1,800 gold. So that's fine. What is our tech like? 113%. We've got it up. And it's going to be up even more once all this changes. Minor addendum. Stability for PI. Yes, please. Can I make any more claims? I can, and we're going to keep making them. I keep forgetting to make them, which we should really do. Um, let's try to get a claim on North Satyaputa. Um, let's make another claim on Shola, maybe. What claim do I want to make down here? Maybe on this section here, maybe. What is this? South on, on Danedu, I think. There we go. That's some more claims on that. Again, all this is just to reduce the war score cost. Um, I think we'll be able to get the war going next episode. I probably won't be able to do it this episode. won't have time. Because I do need to get this all down. But in the next one, we can definitely do that. Uh, Brahidrata Shunga died. You were the commander of the second army. Uh, they refused our offer, so... God damn it, my daughter didn't get married. Which is a shame. What about my other daughter? Uh, what about you? I oh, know you're already married. Okay, good. Well, one of them's married, at least. Um, now we need a, another commander. No, I don't. You're a governor force now, and you're going to be called the Dravida governor? Is it Dravida? Yeah, it's Dravida. So you're going to be Dravida governor. Dravida. 
Governor. Oh god, I'm on cap locks again. For god damn it. Why am I always on like cap locks? I don't know. Vida Governor. Okay, now it's done properly. Thank god for that. And where do I go next? What do I do? I need more... Oh god, I'm not importing anything else here. I'm losing something. What am I losing? I need more stuff to import. How much food? I've got more... I know, I need more grain. Crap, we need like way more grain. Or more livestock. Anything. Let's get more livestock. We just need more food. Uh, what are my policies, by the way? That's a good question. Hot conversion speed, slave output, more of armies, which is what I want. A shame of a governor. Apparently this guy's been having vast and lavish parties. You are loyal to me, so... Again, not my problem. I'm going to lose popularity. We're so unpopular. We need, to, we need the war. At the end of the war, we should become more popular, so... This guy is a douche. I need to bribe you again. And um, we have potential civil war in Vanavasi. Where is Vanavasi again? Oh, that's just down here. This is this tiny little bit here, which we can easily deal with. Without a shadow of a doubt, we can deal with that. You're occupying that, which is quite good, which will allow me to take that off you in the next war without declaring another war for this tiny bit. You're down here. Where's my other 20k stack? Yeah, you're coming down as well, which is good. So I've got my four 20k stacks down here. Still building your road, buddy? You are still building your road, that's good. A seeking a patron. The governor of Majidessa wants to be my wants me to be his patron. I can, I'll increase your finesse stat, why not? No reason why that can't happen. Aha, now it's spreading down. Yes, it's working, it is working. We like, we like, we like, we like. Spreading like wildfire down here, which is what we want. Still losing province loyalty in these sections, which is annoying. But it is slowly increasing. I am going to swap this out now to this. It's going to decrease a little bit quicker, but... It is what it is. Hopefully we can get it changing pretty quickly. Here it's changing as well. Here it's slowing down. We'll lose conversion again. I'm going to gain some tyranny by doing this, but I'm really not that bothered. Um, I just want to kind of convert this quickly. Yeah, here it's going down. It's just slowly stabilizing. About this section. Here it's rising a bit now. Not much, but it is rising. Here it's rising quite a lot, which means we're going to change it back. And now we can actually get this changed. Okay, we lose the proceedings. So what do I do here? Oh, Omen Power plus 15%. Lose 5 stability. I'm going to take that. Because Omen Power would increase by 5%, which means we'll increase the pop conversion speed. So we're up to 10% now, so that is well worth it. That is literally well worth it. Uh, can I take any more tech here? Not at the moment, but at the end of the road building, I can probably take the extra... The Overseers would be quite nice. Like, National Slave Output would be fairly useful, I think. And I might go for that. Um, how many men do you have? You have 7,000 troops, but no manpower. You've got 27,000, though, so you're the dangerous one, Shona. Power and devotion. Oh, we gained free stability back. Thank you. Good stuff. I like that. Very good stuff indeed. 10 aggressive expansion. We are so damn close. So close we'd love to do the war. Right, come on, buddy. You know you can build your road. Still going all the way around here, aren't you? Yeah, you've still got to look at how much road you've got to build still. You've got to build a hell of a lot. But a lot has been done, which is good. This is good, this is good. Um, oh, barbarians. Where? Oh, there again, you kidding me? Alright, let's go and deal with him. Let's go and kill the guy. Um, do I make more claims? I do make more claims. We need more claims. Um, new, so I've got claims on everything there. And then I want another claim on this guy. What is Pandia? That's down here. Maybe north, whatever it is there. Yeah, so I don't have my like, whole claim on everything here. Again, I don't think I'm going to be able to take everything in one go. Two wars might be enough to take everything and unite it all and then do the decision. Um, but that's not going to be for a little while yet. Still got a little bit of time. I only make 18 gold now. It's going down. A oh, yes. Tribal people request migration. Thank you. This is, this is like great. I can get rid of tribals and I get gold for it. So, yeah. Bye-bye, guys. 900 gold for getting rid of four tribals. Go away. Go away, buddy. Which means I can now buy... Um, probably go for the Overseers, National Slave Output. Now, what am I making? 18 with the Overseers. It would increase quite a bit, I think. Um, so, I was making 18. We should make a little bit more now. 19, 20, 21. 
21. Yeah, the increase is okay. Not as much as I expected, to be honest. I was expecting it to be a little bit more, but oh well, it is what it is. Uh, we've got another guy that peed off with us. Um, the same governor of our panther. Yeah, you're dying, though. Uh, I'm going to wait for you to die. You're going to be dead way before the Civil War breaks out. And since you've got a big power base, you're the one that's really annoying us. Um, Hatishenga Shunga died. He was the Sim Tatar. I need a new one. And I am. Why are you all corrupt? Because you're deceitful. And you're just basically crafty. So I'm going to place you. You're not corrupt at all. And you would do a good job for us. What else can I do here now? Nothing else. Religion. Spread. Spread, Buddhist. Spread. I know you want to. It's nearly 70% now, actually. That's quite high. Oh, they're against inflammation, which is not good. And I am probably going to seek treatment for you because I can. Because I don't really want you to die. In 22 months, we have the province of Barasi, which is going to rebel. Which is down here. And I can easily take care of these guys. So I'm going to move you next door. You're already next door, I think. And we can actually stop him. Uh, Granaries have been raided. And I am going to not cover the cost myself. But I'm going to... A, some PI and some manpower for it. I don't want to spend the gold because I need the gold. I will spend that. Right, where's my little 10k road builders? Still going, buddy? Yeah, he's still going. Got a long way to go. Really damn long way to go. Where's that? Oh, treatment successful. Good. That Kai Vata guy needs to die. Please die. These, they both need to die. He's nearly dead as well. I've got another claim on you guys. I could probably start making one more. In what province, though? South uh, Sajari? Where's that? Where's South Sajari? Here? Is it, is, it, is it here? Or is it this one? Or is it this bit here? I don't know. Um, which one do I want to go for? Maybe the province of Coda. Yeah, let's do Coda. It's expensive. There's a lot of pops there and a lot of stuff. This land down here is going to be awesome. Look at the farmlands that we're going to get down here. Look at the beautiful cities we are going to be able to take. God, this is going to be awesome. We're going to be able to get a lot of stuff. What's your tech like, by the way? Oh, he's ahead of me. You bastard. Oh, he's not. We're level. We're pretty much level. Oh, the governor's finally dead. So this is like the governor who had a lot of power base. So you're kind of gone. And now I'm going to put someone who's, like, loyal to me and he's got, like, no... You're arrogant. I don't like that. You're loyal. On you go, buddy. So that one is loyal. Now I only have one other guy that is peed off. Or this guy here. But you're going to die as well, I think. In 24 months. Um, you have got 22... I think he might die before it fires, actually. Which would be pretty good. Um, you're going to die before it fires, definitely. So I don't need to bribe anyone because we're all going to die. But that's the problem solved. So now we just wait. We wait for them to die. <laughs> I like it how we have to be horrible and wait for people to die. Um, Sholo, they have no gold. They have... Yeah, I can take these guys on pretty easily. If I keep these together, I could open two fronts. Ideally, I would like another stack or a Merc stack, ideally. But at the moment, I can't maintain them because I don't make enough gold. And how come? Because we're paying a lot of wages and army maintenance. Um, another guy died. That is good. I'll gain 6 stability for 10 PI, yes please. And um, let's cool down the pop conversion speed again. Let's go for a tradition, do I want a tradition? War elephant defense, that would be nice. But now I'm going to keep it for the war, the um, military experience. It's going to help us. It's always going to be useful. Um, you're nearly dead. You're nearly dead. Just keep making sure they're going to die. I don't want the civil war to fire. It's important that it doesn't. Uh, where are you going, buddy, now? Still going all the way down here. And Vanavasi are leading a war of dependence against us. Doesn't matter. I can just finish these guys off. They've got no forts on here. And I've got my two armies next door. So they're screwed. Whatever happens. Got to make sure the Salukins aren't planning anything as well. Now, they're not planning to kill us. Which is good. Hopefully they'll plan to strike on this side. They shouldn't be planning to kill us. We're fairly big. I don't think they need to go against us. Uh, we'll just take this back quickly. Um, again. Banish the list. The last of the aggressive expansion can go. And um, you're actually going to stay in next door here. This governor. Need a governor down here. Um, these guys are all corrupt. 
Might impose corruption sanctions on you. Yeah, I'll impose corruption sanctions so then I'll assign you as a governor. Yeah, that solves the problem. Um, what about over here now? Aha, this is spreading. However, he's changed the policies here. Well, he's not that stupid, actually. He's gone for harsh treatment. Which would allow me to maintain the promise loyalty a little bit here. Because it's going to go down. And of course, when we conquer all this, it's going to go down even more. So, that's not a bad idea. That is really not that bad of an idea. However, we could do with this going a little bit quicker. We're going to leave it as it is for the moment. I think that is the best thing to do. Uh, barbarians over here, are you kidding me? Oh god, they're gonna... No, we need to get you guys... Oh yeah, you're gonna go and deal with them. Quickly, Governor, go and deal with them. Please do. Yeah, so the Governor's dealt with him. Yeah, the Governor's won. That's good. Thanks, Governor boy. Cheers, buddy. At least a disloyal Governor who's not a total douche. I need a new Governor down here as well now. Um, your province commerce income goes down, don't want you... You're fairly loyal, but you get local tax down. Um, yeah, I'm going to put you anyway. It's... I don't want to get local tax down. Um, not really. You've got province commerce, but you're corrupt. You've got citizen output and research points. You'll do just fine, my friend. So seven months until the Civil War fires. Wow, you're really peed off. The governor of Gandhara. Drive you. That solves the problem, at least. And um, I think I'm going to end the episode here, people. What we'll do with the next one, we'll get the war going. Um, I could definitely, like, kill them all. Um, who are you allied with? What about Shola? What about you? You're allied with the same people, pretty much. I mean, you bring in Shera and Daraputa and Andara. You bring in... The same. They've basically got a big defensive league against me. Um, which is slightly... Actually, no, they've got no men down here. I can easily take these guys. I might upgrade the army a little teeny weeny weeny bit. I am really tempted to do so. Um, I am actually incredibly tempted to do so. Can I upgrade the army? I think I might. Quickly before we go off. I'll get two of each extra. So we'll go for two archers, two chariots two light horsemen in that one we'll do the same here then we'll do some extra heavy cav some extra light cav in here I'm not going to get any more war elephants because it's too much then here I'll do the same Okay, so that's a little bit better. That's an extra, like, 10,000 men nearly, which would help us fight the potential war. We have the gold to do it, I think. Um, I would like some more, but it is what it is. Um, anyway, as per usual, thank you so much for joining me. If you enjoyed things, please don't hesitate to hit that like button down below. And if you want to see some more Imperial Rome content, then please consider subscribing to the channel for more. It really does help the channel grow. And, of course, hopefully catch you all in the next one. Bye for now.